Hi, my name is Jesse Ramick. I'm a postdoc at Carnegie Institute working at the Department of Terrestrial Magnetism, and I study continental crust formation on the early Earth. And uh, what we do is a lot of uh, isotopic and geochemical analyses of old rocks that we collect from around the world. Uh, and to study how and when they formed, when and how continents grew um, on the early Earth. Well, one of the one of the fundamental things that we don't understand about our Earth is, is when and how continents grew. And, and the fact that we have continents on Earth as a major is a very important um, part of what makes our life, our planet, habitable and what, what makes it unique in the solar system. And we really don't understand how and when these continents were extracted from the mantle. So that is the, the main sort of goal of our research program, is to understand uh, the timing and, and mode mechanism for formation of continents. The reason that understanding when continents grew is important uh, is because, first of all, Earth is the only planet in our solar system that we know to have continents. Uh, the continents have a control over the composition of the atmosphere and ultimately led to the evolution of life as we know it. We only exist because continents are here, most likely. And uh, also continents host a lot of very valuable mineral resources that we use in society all the time. So understanding when and how they form could help us understand where to look for more valuable mineral resources that, that we require for our society. One of the main questions when studying when continents formed is the when part of it. You need to know the age of rocks that we think represent continents. So what we do is we go out into the field and we collect these rocks and we need to know the age of them. Um, so we bring them back and there's certain minerals that we can look at that are very good for geochronology. So we bring them in the lab. What we're doing today is using a laser system to uh, ablate the zircons and then uh, look at the uranium lead isotope ratios which give us an age. So really a fun fundamental part is understanding when these rocks form, when they crystallize from a magma. And that's what we're doing today in this lab. That noise that we're hearing is actually the laser firing and you can see little flashes here which are the laser hitting a sample and the laser, the, the sample is then carried through a, a variety of tubes and, and put into the mass spectrometer and what we're seeing here is the uranium, the signals of uranium and lead that are coming right from the zircon mineral. And so we can determine the ratios here and, and figure out what the, when the age of that mineral grew and therefore the age of when this package of continental crust grew. At AGU, I will be convening a session on Monday morning and then I also have a poster uh, at Tuesday afternoon on some of the work that we've done here recently.